Who's ready to dance? I'm ready to dance. And yeah, say yo. I am Stephanie, your fellow dancer, here to teach you Love Me Right by EXO. I will be teaching you the first verse and the first pre chorus. So, in this video, I'm trying a new method. I'm gonna be explaining what I'm doing more and seeing how that works out. So please comment down in the bottom if you like this, the way I'm doing it now, or you want me to go back and do the way I did before. So, let's get started. Okay, we're gonna start out by putting our feet next to each other, hip distance. And then you're gonna place your hands on the front side of your hips. And you're gonna look down. And then you're gonna jump to the back, like a small jump, with your right foot first. So it's gonna look like this. Okay? So, when you do that, your arms are gonna come up like this and come back down. So it's gonna look like this. Once you come down from the little jump, you're gonna bring your left leg next to your right leg, turning to face the front right left corner. We're gonna go bring your left arm up front and your right arm back to the back. So you're gonna go one, two, releve, and slowly fall and slowly rotate your arms like that. As you hit the ground, you come back up slowly, and you're going to walk to the right to give yourself room for the next part. And then step, and then slide forward with your right foot, and then bring your left foot next to your right foot, turning to face left. Okay. So you're going to slide forward with your right foot. And you're gonna kind of slap your wrist down, so like that. So once you do the slap down with your wrist, you're gonna kick front with your left foot, contract a little bit, and bring your right hand, flexed hand inward, forward. You can bend your right knee as well. You do that. Bring your left foot in, pop your chest out, bring your right hand back to your chest. Shift your weight to your left foot, and then slowly slide your right foot out while slowly extending your right hand up, about head level. And don't forget to flex. And then you're going to jump with your right foot to face right, just like this. Once you jump, face right, you're gonna cross your arms over to each other in front of yourself. You're gonna turn your head to the right. And then you're gonna bring your arms out to the side, and you're gonna turn your head left. After that, you're gonna pivot your left foot or your left heel forward. Face front, leave your right, right foot behind, and extend your arms to the right upward diagonal. Don't, don't forget to flex your hands as well. Okay. So it's one, two, three. So after that, you're going to bring your right foot forward, or your right heel forward, 
bring your arms. And place your hands somewhere near your chest like you're holding suspenders. And you're gonna flop your arms up. And then you're gonna push your bring your right foot back and push your left heel forward and you're gonna flop again. And you're gonna bring your left foot back and bring your right foot heel forward and flop again. And then you're gonna jump. So your feet are hip distance and your right left fist is in front of your chest. So when you're right, you're gonna start back and right fist, left fist is in front of your chest. And uh, hit your hit right hip to the right. Bring your left hip to the left. And then circle around back to the right. Okay. So the arms, and then with your hips, you go one, two, one, two. Circle it up to your head and bring your left hand to your hip. Okay, so it's going to be one and two and. and don't forget to bring your left foot behind your right foot. Once you do that, you're going to kind of scooch forward on your right foot and kind of kick your left foot forward. So it's that. So you're going to do that twice with these hands, so it's one, two, and then you're going to circle your wrist to the left, so one, two, and point forward, and you're going to do that twice as well with the foot, so it's going to look like this. Once you do that, you're going to place your, you're going to place your right foot in releve or in arch to the right and shrug your shoulders up and back. Slowly bend your right leg more. This is going to look like this. Then you're going to bring your right, right arm up, palm up left arm up, palm up, and then you're going to push down and bring your weight on your right foot and pick up your left foot. You're going to cross over to the right, down, pull away on your right foot, up, down, swing right leg forward, down, up, down, forward, place your left foot next to your, on the right side of your right foot, and arch. So, it's gonna be down, up, down, swing, down, up, down, swing, place. Okay. Now your arms are gonna be like, you're gonna circle your wrist up and bring them down. And circle your wrist again and bring them down again. Cross your arms over yourself like you're hugging yourself. Bring them to your shoulder. And then bring them up so your pinky, so your quarter fingers are pointing up to the ceiling. And look like this. We're gonna do a little body wave back. So 
and back, bringing your left foot front, up in front, and you're going to place it back down, so face left, do another body roll, bring your arms down, so your left, right arm is crossed over your belly, and your left arm is crossed over your back, and then you're going to hit down, with another body wave, you're going to hit down, I'm going to hit down with this, I'm going to do another body wave, and then you place your right foot next to your left foot, hip distance to face front, I'm going to do another body wave, and hit. So it's going to look like this. So it's one, two, three, four. So the next part is we're gonna we're gonna take a step back with our right foot, bend your knees slightly, and bring your bring your arms up to a cross up to your chest and kind of bounce, bounce twice. Bounce twice. On your left foot, a distance to your right foot. Bring your hands on top of each other. About in front of yourself. Then you're gonna go down. You're gonna bend your knees. Bring, push your hands down. Bring them all back up. And you're great. Gonna bend your knees and jump. Take a step forward, take two steps forward. First to right, first to left. Okay. Gonna look a little like this. So it's one, two bounces. Bring your arms, push down, push up, jump, right, left. So walking forward. We're in this position and bring our palms up, cross them over, and then separate them. And then after that, bring your left foot forward and bend both knees. Bring both arms up. And then bring straighten your legs, come up on releve, and push your arms down. Push your fists down like you're grabbing something and pulling it down. And then you're gonna lower from, from releve, and you're gonna bring, and then cross your right, you're gonna bring your right foot about hip distance, still an arch with your knee facing the wall, and you're gonna kind of punch down through the left, under your left arm. And then you turn to the right. So you're going to turn back to the right, face to the left again. It's going to look like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So facing left, I'm going to take a left, your left foot towards the back, and you're going to bend your knees, and you cross your arms over each other, so like this. You're going to pick up your right leg while still bending your right, your left knee, make sure your right leg is still bent. And then you're going to circle your arms out and under your right leg. So it's going to look like this. You're going to take a step 
Place your right foot back a distance from your left foot. Bring your arms, extend your arms out. Pick up your left foot and then bring your arms under your left leg like you're trying to hug it. Except don't actually hug it because that would be painful. That. Total is going to look like, look like this. Then bring your arms and your fists up in front of yourself, down chest, chest height. Bring both legs next to each other and then bend your knees and slowly move to face about right. Okay, so it's going to look like this. After the rotating to face right, you're going to kind of run back a few steps really quickly. I'm going to wait one beat. So one, two. So you're going to be, it's going to be one and, and then you take your step. Bring your hands up to your chest. And you bend and kind of extend your right foot. Still bent. And then also pick up your left foot into about knee height. So it's kind of like this. And then bring your right arm up above your head and bring your left arm up to shoulder height. And then take, place your left foot back down. And do it to the other side. And you need to bring your arms like you're up to your side. Gonna roll them up. One, two, rolling up. One, two. Rolling up, and we'll do a little I'm gonna jump back while kicking your left. I'm gonna jump back with your right foot while kicking your left foot forward, and bring your arms over each other. So it's gonna be this. And then bring your feet back together again. Put your hands up on your head, and slowly lower down. Lower down and bring your arms to your side as well. And then we kind of pick up your right leg, place it back down. And also bring your arms on top of each other and slowly rise. So, total. So it's going to be like this. Row shoulders, kick front, bring back, put hands on head, lower down, kick, come back up. Once you come back up, you want to do the place your left foot to the left. Slowly drag in. And you're gonna place your right foot to the right hip distance. 
Bring your hand, on, left hand on your hip. Point to the right. Put your head down. Kind of bend your knees too. Slowly drag in. Bring your left foot forward. Bring your left arm up to chest. Point front. Slowly bring back. So it's going to look kind of like this. Great job guys, now let's do it at normal speed. Great job, guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned part of this dance with me. That makes me really happy. And please subscribe for more cool dance tutorials like this if you haven't. That would be awesome. And also, please comment down below if you think you like me talking more. Because I can do that. Otherwise, I'll go back to what I did before. And I'll see you guys in the next part. Happy dancing!